to be piecing together in a way that I saw them happen my first year here, and I'm, I can't wait to get the role. So how badly did you guys need a fresh start like this? Um, to kind of wipe the slate clean and yeah, no, I, I feel like we definitely need a fresh slate. Um, obviously, I I thank Coach Rador and I thank all the coaches that brought me here and they gave me the opportunity. Um, obviously, all the guys here when they were brought under Fedora, and you know, it, it's something that we all we always grateful to him for. Um, and not everything was his fault. You know, it's it's people were weren't exactly where they needed to be all the time and. Misfits and missed tackles and misplays and missed big opportunities and things like that. We should put games out in the fourth quarter a lot last year and we didn't do that. Um, but at the end of the day, you know, he's he was our head man and you know, unfortunately, it all fell on him. Um, but the fresh start is is definitely a new fresh breath. You know, guys are are happy to be here. They're happy to be around. Um, Mac has he's taken us in and. He's built a level of trust that we can all kind of build around, and I feel like we're all comfortable, and if we're not, then we're going to be able to get there. Now that you've gotten through spring practice with this whole new regime here, is there anything about being a part of this program under the new regime that kind of surprised you in a positive way? Um, I feel like everybody... Obviously, all the everybody has a different style of coaching, you know, and they have a different ways of getting their players fired up and everything like that. Everybody, every coach has a different style of how they want their players to play. But I feel like this coaching staff has really embraced every single person that um, that's here. You know, Max always said, if if you can't play here, we're gonna find you. Uh, if, like here as in offense, we're going to find you a, a place to play on defense, see if you can contribute there. If you can't do it there, you can contribute on special teams. And I feel like everybody's kind of trying to find their niche, and it's, we haven't seen that in the past. Usually if guys kind of get disgruntled through that position, you know, obviously the first thought is try to find a better opportunity somewhere else. But people are staying in-house to try to find different opportunities here, and that's kind of because of the, the trust and the, the new culture that we've built here. Um, so that that genuine that genuine care that I feel like the coaches have brought in, uh, that's that's definitely something that surprised me, uh, especially as a new coaching staff. Usually, is I I really thought it it might have been before you know we heard about the hire. I thought it was going to be a hostile takeover. You know, I, I didn't know what was going to happen. You know, I, I've been here for four years, and all of a sudden, for my last year. Um, it was going to be a brand new face in front of me. I didn't know how who he was or how he was going to act, but I, I can't complain at all. I'm, I'm I would imagine that natural human nature would be to be a little concerned about how yeah. things would be. How quickly were those concerns alleviated? Um, I wouldn't say quick. Obviously, you know, we had to come in and we had to build their trust because at the end of the day, they have to put us out in the field. And but at the same time, they have to get our trust as well because we're the people that go out on the field. So if you don't have anybody to put out there, then you're not gonna have a program. So it's kind of a, that mutual trust that we had to build. You know, it was, it was something that it, it took time, and it's, some people is still growing. Um, some people aren't there yet, and hopefully they'll they'll get there soon. Um, but I feel like for the majority of the team, everybody's bought in, everybody's locked in, everybody's ready to go. And as a result, how much further is this team ahead of where it was at the end of November? Oh, it's much further. I, I've seen guys that you know. A big attitude shifts, huge attitude shifts. You know, guys that usually would come out to practice and, you know, try to go through the motions and try to go out and compete. Um, I feel like that fresh slate is definitely a part of it. You know, you have these new coaches who you are working to make a good fresh impression. And some of these guys are really taking advantage of that, so I commend them for that. Thanks, man. Appreciate it.